All right, welcome back to the channel. I'm King of Bad. In today's video, we're back playing Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I do believe we just landed on whatever planet it is that we built the lightsabers on. I guess I'm not really sure. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe. All that stuff helps me grow the channel. Blah blah blah. I need to figure out what planet we are on though, because I forgot what it was called as we were landing. I know we just destroyed our own lightsaber on Dathomir, uh, thinking that we we're fighting our master whose name I can't remember right now. Let's see, where are we? I think we believe it's down, yeah. Ilum? Yeah, it's Ilum. Okay. It's been a long time since I've been here. As you know, many Jedi have come to Ilum to find their kyber crystal. I remember. Master Yoda guided us to the entrance, but after that, we were on our own. Not something I wasn't accustomed to, but that didn't make it any less challenging. I was trained by following strict protocols. Prepared for everything. Or so I thought. Maybe that was a lesson, Cal. You can't know everything. You can only trust that you are able to handle whatever you face. I need a second. Yeah, she was talking so much. I'm trying to get going. All right, so. Have you seen anything of like Clone Wars? I know there's that episode. It's been a while. Yeah. There's that episode with the like. Every Jedi comes here as a kid. Cadets. What are they called? Padawans? Whatever. There were the kids that they had. It was like a Wookiee. The Wookiee's the only one I remember. But those guys, they showed up and got their lightsabers and showed their trials and tribulations, I guess, or whatever they had going on in there. I saw something online earlier today that said when you fall into a crack in the ice in Mount Everest. This is the worst blizzard I've ever seen. Storm, the temple. It all feels connected somehow. You fall into a cavern in Mount Everest, like I guess it's like a crack in the ice. They're V-shaped, so what happens is you'll fall and you'll slowly keep sinking more and more as your body heat melts the ice. So eventually you'll get to a point where it's so narrow that you can't like uh like inhale basically. The pressure's so tight on your chest that you can't inhale anymore. And then you die, basically. Uh so don't climb Mount Everest. It's pointless at this. At this one is pointless anyways. I don't really know where I'm supposed to go anymore. Oh, I forgot we can climb this stuff now. So it's a similar setup to uh, that one temple we went into. I think it was on Zepho, maybe. It was like Temples of Wind or something like that. It was pretty early in the game, probably first or second episode. Yeah, well, we opened this up, but I don't know where this leads to. It looks like this sun area over here, or whatever's wherever this light is coming from. It used to be beautiful. The warmth is nice. A magnifying window. Okay, well, I feel like I'm not going. I feel like I'm going the right way now. I thought I found a secret or something. There's so much stuff to explore right now. I don't really know where to go. I remember this room. Master Yoda melted that door to let us into the caves. That okay. Of course, with that crystal, the light passed through it and carried it to the I bet we can do it too. I don't know if there's anywhere to hold this open it. Or maybe I just have to come back up here later. Pretty sure this is probably going to be how it goes because there's no way I can get back and forth from across. Otherwise, not unless I go down and all the way around. Which I actually feel like it's the right way, so maybe I need to do that, but I need to figure out how to get back all the way up to the top. Or back up to there, at least.
Okay, cool. I'm glad I realized that I could just pull this into the light. Okay, let's see what's down in this cave now. I, I guess there's going to be some way for me to move this. Uh, let's see. But it looks like that crest is actually useless. It felt like it was sort of a misdirect, but I feel like it was also because I ran around for a while uh, confused. Yep, there we go now. It just took me a second to get the part where we opened the other door. I was trying to go straight to the main door. I don't think we have enough for a new skill yet, but now we can make our way deeper into the cavern. Let's see what we can find. It's probably going to be one of those sliding portions in a second, to be honest. It's usually how it goes. Not what I expected at all. I forgot how to dive. Uh, okay. Okay, so there's like volcanoes down here, so that makes sense on why it's melted. And it wouldn't make sense for there to be any secrets down here. There shouldn't be that many memories in the area, and then there's not going to be an imperial cache down here either. Or it'd be coming from those cracks underwater, but it's be crazy. Up here. Oh yeah, he just got wet and then came out in an arctic cave, pretty much. There's a glowing thing over there, so I'm definitely going that way. I need to figure out where I need to go first. Oh, okay. Damn. Kind of slammed on longer right there. Good Geodes. Be okay. Oh, I jumped over it. <laughs> All I have to do is drop down at that point. No creatures down here either. Oh, no. Okay. getting stronger let's hurry it looks like there's multiple ways to get to this point let me see what's behind me down here Ooh. I should climb on the wall instead of just dropping in it's just a cool little look pretty much in an area that's red I'll just check the map and actually follow it instead of thinking I know where I'm going. Plus, there was nowhere that. How did they find us here? Oh yeah, that's right. Um. Um. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I don't have a lightsaber, so I started trying to fight and realized I couldn't. But, I mean, theoretically, that's gonna defend this spot now, so we should be cool.
That was a nice, cool little sequence. Cool, we got a bigger, bigger life bar now too. I'm glad that worked. All right. Oh. Oh. This is getting more and more disturbing. Not only are there like watcher bots here, which means they're going to be the rest of the empire is probably going to be on their way because they know we're looking for a new crystal now and two that they've actually been inside of here no so that means they probably collected a few kyber crystals at least for their own uses or at least know where to get more if they need to He called out for BD like he wanted him to grab his hand at the last second. Looks like we're gonna fade into a memory in a second. I don't know how his kid self was able to pull his adult self out because he looked pretty scrawny. I understand that he's cold, but he's moving like he hurt his legs, too. That's kind of funny to me, but I feel like they should both work still and be used on both ends of his lightsaber. Failure is not the end, my friend. Time's come. This may be the last you see of me. I can sense the doom of the Jedi Order is upon us. <laughs> no. Failure is not the end. It is a necessary part of the path. Hope will always survive in those who continue to fight. Like you, BD-1. <laughs> I 
I believe you will find someone just as brave and persistent as you have been. And you will help them as you have helped me. But your memory will be completely lost. Are you sure you want to do this? Beginning total memory encryption. Only with a trusted connection will your memories be restored. I believe in you, as I always have. And I believe in whom you choose to replace me. them from me <laughs> Keith I believe in you too buddy <laughs> yeah you're right there's still a chance I kind of zoned out while other dude was talking. <coughs> I kind of like this bluish purple because I kind of want to do the light purple, but I don't also like the general like the Mace Windu purple, I feel like that one is. But I like this, this like more pale purple more. I'm gonna go with that one. It kinda looks normal blue though too, so hopefully we can change the color again later. And sort of put his tinkering skills to work right now. The two crystals, dick. I caught it. I fucking caught it. Kyle's life has been split into to enable devastating force attacks. I read all of that wrong. Why am I not on the thing? Hey, well, now I need to look at this more closely because I didn't know that it would switch off. So now we do have way more colors. I'm using indigo. I didn't want to use the normal, like, purple. I have a bunch of new colors, too. I guess now I can do two completely separate lightsabers. So I can make the ones I want. I like the way power and control looks kind of. And I was using duty and resolve for a long time. I like this one though. Yeah, Magus. I thought it was Magnus for a while. I don't know if that me saying that, <laughs> excuse me, made it into the cut. I don't like the way the sleeves looks the sleeve looks now or the switch looks now. A 
it looks like it might be only one sleeve between both of them. I don't like the leather, but also kind of don't. I don't like this right here. The meter on the other side will make uh, we'll make it duty and resolve. So two different emitters, a switch and a sleeve. We can't change the other emitter or the other switch, I guess. And then we'll stick with what we have. I guess it's gonna stay whatever uh Trilla's lightsaber was. I think this is the only move. It's just like blocking and doing a normal swing. Let me see what happens if I Okay, so it's different for whichever like lightsaber mode you have it in. Okay, let's see if I can make it back to the ship. Be wary, Padawan. You do not choose your crystal. It chooses you. Cool. I think this is that way I looked at before, yeah. They unlock more stuff on the skill tree now. That doesn't look like it. I guess it is just the lightsaber splitting in half because they are just wrapped together in the middle, basically. But I think when I end the video, that, because our objective is to just get back to the ship, I was into here and I'll bring you back after we get back to the ship or as we're walking up to the ship or some shit like that. So for now, that's going to be all. Thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all next time.